Some of you often wonder what I do with uh, my kids and stuff when I see them on the weekends, but this is some of the stuff we, um, we go to like uh, art festivals, flea markets, basically a lot of free things that we can do. We spend a little bit of money on gas. Today we saved money by eating in the car, uh, the van. I cooked up some rice and some of that um, cheap old spam. <laughs> so, you know, that was like a dollar to feed all three of us for breakfast, but um, we're here at the park over it's the one right off Viero like Viero the bridge I forget what the city this is um I forget what city we've been to this park before but it's the one with like a million squirrels I think it was like the land of tiny where there was like a million squirrels but we've got nuts here peanuts I know it's not the most healthy thing for the nut, um the the squirrels but they enjoy them it's like a little snack for them but you can see they're digging for their own nuts. There's all plenty of nuts and food on the floor. But they come right up and they pull it out of your hand. You know, if you don't move, if you don't freak them out. You can you can throw it down, but this one, this brave one here comes right up. This is a little one. I'm going to go ahead and give it to her. Here. She, she's like, here. She didn't want to come up and get it from me because it's a little one. But She's a stage right camera shot. But there's a whole bunch of them. I think they're probably all related. But there was one that we put here at the tree and it was climbing up there, up to the tall branch up there and it was eating it and tossing it on it's our heads. It's still up there tossing um, peanuts on our head. So that's pretty funny. So you see what they do, they bury, they, bury the, um, they bury the food. So they take the peanuts from us and then they bury it. Some of it they eat, they're hungry. Some of it they bury for another day. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how an acorn grows, <laughs> an acorn tree. The squirrels, they pick up the seeds and they run around and they bury it in the ground about two or three inches deep. And that's how the trees get planted. See, that one is planting a tree right there. These are your natural gardeners. They uh, take all the seeds and they plant them. Our friend over here is still a little bit skittish, but um, it comes down and yeah, it, it's like right there, it's peeking at us. See, look. Hi. Well, it's right here. You can grab a nut here if you want, Nick. Off the table. So. This one right here. It's the one that was eating and tossing them on our heads. Do you want one? Come on. Come on. Well, I'll just put it here and you can get it. I can get it from Nick. That other one there said burying something. But yeah, there's a, an art festival going on right now at this park. It is right by the riverfront. It is um, south of Barefoot Bay off US-1. What is this place? I think it's Vero. It's not Vero. Cause Vero Beach is on the other side of the causeway on the beach side, but this is the mainland, it's off US. <gasps> did you see him roll? <laughs> Wonder what happened there, did you see him? He did a barrel roll. Yeah, he did a barrel roll, now they're chasing each other. That was weird. Oh, bite, did you see that? Yeah. Ninja squirrel, and he's chasing the other one. Let's give the other one to Yeah. I just, wow. I didn't mean to start a, a squirrel fight. But yeah, this was the, the place that had like a million squirrels, so it's really cool. There's also, um, I think I think I've made this video before, <laughs> getting like a deja vu here. But not with the, when they actually had the art stuff here, so you can buy all sorts of neat artwork. I didn't want to film it because a lot of artists, you know, they get upset if you film their work. It's copyrighted work. Um, they do have a nice little bathroom you can access here. And then right around that corner, is actually a water park. You can bring your kid here and have them wear swimming chunks and stuff. And they can, you can't go swimming, but they can get wet. It's those sprinkler systems that spray and get everybody all wet. So it's a lot of fun. Um, I won't really show it because there's probably kids playing there and I don't want to get them on camera. But um, yeah, this is kind of one of the activities that I like to do with my kids. Let's see if this one will take it out of our hands. You really shouldn't do this, but you know, these squirrels are so tame, they're, they're used to it. Come on. You can get this one. 
look at um, Plush Eye. It's coming up, but it's still afraid. Are you afraid? Yeah. I need to do it to him. I need to make him freak out over food. You know, seeing how fast the squirrels move, I think they, they are like in a different reality than us. They move very fast. So for them, we move really what? Slow. They're like accelerated. So they're hyper, hyper reality or hyper time. They're able to um, move extremely fast. Yeah? They don't live very long. It is sad. They don't live very long. I don't I don't even think they live five years. I don't want to be a squirrel who drinks without an abuse. There is one of them with a nut or something in his mouth running off, trying to find a good hiding spot. You know, they really had to find it. Look at that one over there on the stump over there. These squirrels are cute. Some people see them as a pest. I actually think they're they're cool. Look at them on there. You see the little one? He's gonna go mess with the big one. He's going after the other guy's nut. I'm gonna um, try to give him a. Well, they don't put trash out for them, but the squirrels they they get they get trash. He's uh, afraid of me. He's on the other side. See his shadow. <laughs> he thinks I don't know that he's there, but I can see his shadow. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw it. It's a little baby. He's, he's skittish. Okay, he'd rather have the acorn, and that's fine. That's a better food, anyways. <laughs> Look at this one here. He's got the peanut. Do you want to give him peanut salad? Oh, you gave him one. You want You want some more to give out? Huh? Yeah. A nice way to spend the weekend. There's also a playground here for those of you with younger kids. It's Indian River is where we're at. This is Indian River Lagoon is near here. Of course the whole lagoon I think is that area right there. But I'm eating a couple nuts. Oh I just came here without my nuts. I'll go get the nuts. So uh, here we have a squirrel in its natural habitat of sitting under a tree. And this one is, you can see, really used to humans. It saw us coming and it, it reacted a little bit, but I'm going to throw some here for it. I'm going to set some down. You notice she doesn't run away because she's um, used to humans, but I'm going to put some right there so she knows. She did get a little bit skittish, but she's not running off because she's um, used to humans. So, it's interesting to watch the young squirrels and the older squirrels. So, you know, the older ones that are used to uh, humans feeding them. They're good because like if they're always like nice or like like humans and then when there's like a bad human they'll come and like hurt them and yep. they won't run away. That's pretty much it. Well the other thing is they're not so much afraid of the human hurting the squirrel. They're afraid of the squirrel hurting the human. Because the squirrels can bite. But here's a fountain. And I was expecting to find money in it, and sure enough, there's at least two pennies in here. <laughs> so a source of income for those of you who come to the park. <laughs> you can get two pennies. Look how, how that squirrel is camouflaged. He looks like a part of the tree right there until he starts moving. There's more here. Ooh, look at him fly. He, he flew like across from one branch to another. Here's another one coming up for food. I, I wonder if like elephants... Hmm? I wonder if like elephants are like... I'm just gonna toss it to him. Doing the same thing we're doing, they're like squirrels. Hmm? Like I wonder if elephants are doing the same thing we're doing to like squirrels. This is like a weird looking nut, like an empty. Us. Yeah. So the... They'll be like, oh look at the human, I'm going to try to feed him. Pretty much. And then they'll come over to you. And they bring you a banana. And they say, I'm going to try to pet this human. Alright. I'm mostly showing the ground because there's a lot of little kids around here. Different families bring their kids. But you can see there is the fountain section back there. 
That's what I was talking about, those spray fountains where people can play. I want to go play. You want to go play? No. Yeah. No. You used to play there all the time when you were younger. I know. Those little squirrels. They're so used to people feeding them. You know, you know what I just noticed on the ground? What? Peanut shells. Yeah. Lots of them. So guess what that tells me? <laughs> We're not the only ones giving them peanuts. Who's used to it? Yeah. There's like, there's a million yeah. peanuts here on he the ground. that one squirrel, that other one, and then the other one gave you a dirty look. <laughs> he looked at you, he's like... Look, look at all these peanuts. They're all over the ground. And we weren't here yet, so... Maybe they're from the last time you could came. No. Here, look at them all. They're all like, does he have a fresh peanut? Here's a fresh peanut. Do you want this one or not? Here. He's looking at me like, I ain't not sure. Oh, this one has a messed up ear. His ear got split. You see that? He's got a split in his ear, so somebody ripped his ear. Or it's another squirrel. Probably another squirrel. I'm gonna throw it to him. His ear got ripped. Right there, he's got a split ear. You see that? He's got three ears. Poor fella. Yep, might have got in a fight. <laughs> you see him? Yeah. He got scared when I made the noise. He, he thought it was. Yeeted. Huh? He yeeted. He <laughs> zipped right out. Anyhow, I'm gonna go ahead and sign off here and just enjoy the rest of the day walking around here with my kids and probably take them somewhere else before they gotta go and um, do some other business, some other errands. Until next time, everyone, I want to thank you for joining us today as uh, we just walked around enjoying our day here at the park, feeding squirrels, and um, just enjoying the art fest. Take care, everyone. Have a great day.